This is Secure Repenter, a gun that is pure reorgasm when used with mags magnetize. Outside of that, well, get ready for some bouncing projectile of pure self damage death. This is Napalm Grenades, a Nightwave mod that modifies the Secure Repenter's projectile into a rocket launcher like ammunition of death. Plus, it adds extra base status chance. When you combine them, they will create a requiem of. Even the gods have fallen to this combo, frustrating isn't it? Well, I'm just kidding, who would be dumb enough to just let your frame eat those explosive rounds? Of course, you would shoot it on a safe distance right? You are not stupid like this guy, wait, why is he still alive? What the fuck puppy smurf, are you allowed to do that? Yes, you bet he can. Because he's a sentient overlord, well, that's a pretty long introduction, but I have a lot of fun doing it, anyway. Welcome to another video, and get ready for another awesome synergy. I call this, the Kamikaze Bomber Revenant, a synergy that combines the explosive power of the Napalm Grenade Secure Repenter, and the invincibility of Revenant. It's pure mayhem, and I guarantee that you will have tons of dumb fun with this synergy. So how do you make this synergy work? Pretty simple, on Revenant's side, all you need are a lot of power strength, and efficiency to maximize his mesmer skin. This is the ability that lets you walk out alive from self damaging weapons like the Napalm Grenade Secure Repenter. Why power strength and efficiency? Power strength does affect the number of invulnerability charges you have, while efficiency for the low energy consumption, of course. A quick but very useful tip is adding Rolling Guard on your mod setup. This arbitration mod is the key to making your Revenant unkillable. The moment you are low on mesmer skin charges, just simply roll to activate the effect of this mod. The 3 seconds invulnerability of rolling guard is sufficient time to recast your mesmer skin ability. On the other hand, my secure repenter build right now is hard to emulate, as I have a super good riven that most of you don't have. I'm not bragging, well, just a little bit, just kidding, it's not that godly, but it will suffice. It has critical chance and damage, to further boost the explosive power of this build. But if you don't have Riven, then you can add Heavy Calibre on this build. The negative accuracy of this mod doesn't hurt Secure Repenter, as it's a projectile based weapon. Also, you can further improve the critical chance of this weapon by adding the Vigilante mod set. You can add Vigilante armaments on your Secure Repenter build, then add Vigilante Pursuit on your Revenant. And lastly, add 4 more Vigilante mods on your Sentinel weapon. If you can equip these, then you have 30% chance of improving those yellow crits to orange crits. Last but not the least, let's talk about the element choice. When I have that riven, the corrosive element is quite good and I can deal with level 100 plus enemies with ease. But for a rivenless setup, the corrosive set would take a couple of shots to take down level 100 plus heavily armored enemies. But we can make some adjustment on our build. Let's take an armor stripping weapon like the pox, and then we can mod our secure repenter with the gas element. And lastly, we can add speed holster on our revenant, so that swapping between our primary and secondary weapon will be much faster. It's a total overkill combo. First, you infect enemies with aids, then you blow them out with your secure repenter. That's nuclear warfare on its full glory. So that's how you make a suicide bomber revenant. Kill those enemies with one big boom, while staying alive after all those damage. Before you leave, please do leave a comment below, and share your thoughts about this synergy. Also, let's, do another giveaway. This time, I will give away an Equinox Prime Access, to celebrate the 75k milestone of our little channel and also, to celebrate the one year anniversary of our Discord server. I will be picking the winner on the comment box below, so be sure to leave some of your thoughts regarding this video. I will announce the winner on my next video so, be sure to like and subscribe, if you haven't yet, so you will be updated on the latest content and giveaways on this channel. Thank you so much for watching, squad leader signing off.